Hey guys, I, I, this video was inspired by a comment by Jim Richards and in reference to a video that I posted uh, yesterday, December 22nd, 2019. Today is uh, December 23rd, 2019 and the name of the video was called Femi X8 SE Color Grading F Long Video Files Post Processing and Jim's comment was right on the money because the video that I made, I left out the section on how to use these uh, RGB curves. And all I did is showed how to use the, the hue saturation curves. But Jim commented that you could do similar things with any recording modes. The key benefit of F-Log is that it gives you more dynamic range to start with. So you can lighten the dark areas and darken the bright areas and manipulate the midtones very similar to raw photos. In other modes, you don't have quite the range to work with, but in all modes, you can play with the brightness, saturation, and sharpness. Best way to explain it is that in other modes, your dynamic range might be from three to eight, or in F-log, it would be one to 10. More usable data at the extreme end, so to speak, and they use a flat log and they use a flat log profile, which has less color data to make room for, for other data instead of color grading data. So if you want to read more of Jim's comments, uh, I would encourage that actually to go and read his comment. It's unbelievable. I have actually pinned it so you guys can uh, have access to it right on the top of the page. So getting back to the video, this is the video that I posted and um, I originally had set it with these curves here which I saved my settings for that and this was the, the settings that I had for that video and I'll go ahead and just go ahead and play the video and show it to you before. This is the Femi X8 flying under the bridge, you can barely see that the train here but you can see the dark areas and the light areas are are pretty much a huge difference in contrast right okay so that's the video and um, this is without those curves so I'm going to go ahead and put those um, curves back again and add a few things to it. So let me go ahead and apply that Femi F-Log uh, curve that I created. I'm going to add some sharpness to it to give it a little bit sharper details. And I'm going to push it up to about 40. That looks about right. And then we're going to play with the contrast curve, right? This white button on the, the VSDC video editor and this is a pro version and I'm gonna add a point to this guy in the middle and then I'm gonna move the point a little bit up here and I am gonna move this point somewhere around here and then I'm gonna add I don't think that's maybe too much light. Maybe not. I mean, you can really see the train there. I think that curve about there might be right. That's just definitely too, too, too much light. Bring it up here like so. So you can see by playing the curves, you can really affect the way the video looks, right? You tr we're trying to get the, the, the data out of this dark spot here, and I believe that did it. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and leave it just like that. So what I'm going to do now is I'll put a short clip together of what the video looked like comparing f vlog file without any grading to what I just now created and then we'll compare the video of the color graded that I used in the video that I released versus 
this color grade that we see right now with this saturation. And I think I'm probably going to increase the saturation a little bit here too. Let's, let's increase the saturation. Make it, I think that's way too much, but somewhere around here is going to work. All right. So I'm going to be quiet. I'll go ahead and create that little video clip and then um, we'll get back to the video. All right. See you on the other side of the video. Okay, so this is the video that I put together to do that comparison for you guys. So to kind of give you the visual beginning to the end. And then we're going to show you the difference between what I posted, this color graded. And this is with the changes that I just recently made. So this is the video that I put together. And uh, I'll sh show you the end result. All right, so let's jump into that next. All right, guys, I'm back. And on the left side, you see the original Evlog file from the Femi X8 SE flight under the bridge. And on the right, you see the color graded file that I just created for you guys. So we use this between the two, especially bringing out those the details out of those shadows, right? And what you see now is the color graded video that I posted yesterday. And on the right is the video that I just created for you all. So if you guys want to see more of this type of videos, tutorials, please let me know in the comments below. I look forward to making it out. Let's jump into the final video. So like I said earlier, let us know if you guys are interested in uh, seeing more of this type of videos. I appreciate your guys' feedback. And as usual, thank you for watching. And we'll see you guys in the next video. You guys have a happy holidays and a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Bye-bye.